If you are stopping for the very first time, please hit the subscribe button and please hit the bell notification button so you can be the first to be notified when we drop a new video. Well, for the past couple of hours, the president of Zimbabwe, Emerson Nangagwa, has been under fire after this particular chief of Mudzi, who goes by name Mukota, actually passed on. Well, he was not just the chief, he was also a member of parliament for the president's party, that is the ZANU PF. Well, right now, the president is actually not finding peace on line because people feel like this particular demise and of course the death of two other people was because of him we'll be talking about that in this video so please do all to stay glued watch to the end do not forget to subscribe and do turn on the bell notification button so you can be the first to be notified well we got this particular information from a popular journalist on twitter who goes by the name hope well chinono well he captioned his tweet with something like former mudzi zanup ef member of parliament and of course recently installed chief mokota who goes chief of mukota who goes by name newton kachepa died this morning at the marondera hospital from injuries sustained in a car accident in murewa when i talk about bad roads lack of ambulances and dilapidated hospitals zanu pf accuses me of driving an anti zanu pf political agenda the looting of public funds and plunder of the country's natural resources by ZANU PF elites has dire and fatal consequences, and these consequences will locate you regardless of your political party affiliation. The consequences are there for all, including in ZANU PF, to see. They continue to manifest. So I feel like the short and long about this particular tweet is that the president is indirectly responsible for what happened to the chief of Mokota, uh, Newton Kachepa. Well, we're getting this information right now, and in as much as it's so disturbing, the president really has to say something because it was actually somehow because of him that this uh, this chief had to pass on, and of course two others. Well, I feel like if those bad roads were being fixed, if ambulances were being provided, I think somehow maybe this these men wouldn't have passed on. All the same, we are still waiting for the state and of course the government to say something concerning one of its own and of course how this man passed on.